From pits of man to sinkholes of nature, you might be surprised how many gaps in the earth there are. I'm Bob from World 5 List. Join me as I reveal 10 huge holes found in the earth. Number 10. Mount Baldy this series of holes actually baffles scientists. The Indiana Dunes National Park was once a great tourist attraction, and it has a unique history all of its own. But in 2013, things began to get a little weird. The sandy dune literally swallowed up a six-year-old boy, but don't worry, he made it out okay. What happened is that the sinkhole suddenly appeared beneath him out of nowhere, and it took three hours to get him out. I'm sure it was scary, but it could have been a whole lot worse. After the first documented occurrence, more of them would follow, and this is where things get strange. Because of the composition of the sandy dune on Mount Baldy, this shouldn't happen. There's no air pockets or any other factors that would cause sinkholes, yet they appear so randomly and so frequently that the area had to be shut down to civilians. Still though, there's no rhyme or reason as to why it happens, but scientists are trying to prevent this by planting grass in the area. The theory is that the roots of the grass can help stabilize things, so let's all hope that they're right. Number 9. The Devil's Sinkhole Sinkholes are a natural phenomenon that are very dangerous, as you can see from what I just told you in the previous entry, but they also can create some pretty wondrous stuff. The Devil Sinkhole in Edwards County, Texas, for example, is one such place. This massive sinkhole is a fully formed hole at 50 feet wide, and what's more, it's 350 feet deep. Still though, that's not the most amazing part. Once you get all the way down, you're going to find yourself in a cave, one that's populated by Mexican free-tailed bats, tons of them in fact. Now technically, you can't go down into the sinkhole, it's actually forbidden, however you can observe the devil's sinkhole, and if you time it right, you'll actually be able to see the bats flying out and into the sky. Number 8. The Bingham County Mine but first, do you know what the deepest hole on Earth is? Let me know about it in the comments below. The answer's coming up, and if you're new here, be sure to subscribe and turn on your notifications before you go. Not all holes and gaps in the Earth are naturally made. We've been around for a long time, and we've made our impression on the planet. But no doubt, one of the most impressive things we've ever done is the Bingham County Mine, along with the Berkeley Mine. These mines are impressive on numerous scales and levels to the extent that the Bingham is actually the world's largest copper mine, and Berkeley isn't too far behind that. Bingham is nearly two and a half miles wide and three quarters of a mile deep. 1,900 acres of land helped to make up this mine, and Berkeley isn't too bad, being one mile wide and a half mile deep. Work would first begin on the Bingham Mine in 1906, making it over 110 years old. And yet, most surprisingly, it's still an active mine. No kidding, you can go there and see the mining still taking place. The place is respected, so respected in fact that it's been dubbed a national landmark, and there's even a visitor center. The same goes for Berkeley, where you can get in and see everything for a mere $2 admission fee. Number 7. The Three Holes of Siberia I'm going to talk about a trinity of holes, but they're all in one location, being Siberia. How these holes were formed are believed to be from one singular instance within the Earth itself, so despite them being in different places, sometimes miles apart, they really are connected. The first hole is massive, with a 300-foot diameter at best. Even more interesting than that, there's a lake at the bottom, so it makes you wonder how it happened. The second one is only 50 feet across, but the third one is a mere 15 feet. However, it's also cone-shaped and said to go over 300 feet down. Variances aside, scientists honestly don't know exactly how they were formed. They were recently discovered, but all signs point to them being around for at least a few years. More so, the way they were formed seems to coincide with theoretical science principles, but it can't be proven because they weren't there when they were formed. The mystery continues with the holes, and you have to wonder if these are truly unique or if there's more out there we haven't found yet. Number 6. The Earth's Heartbeat 
There are two different boreholes on my list, meaning holes that were drilled by man. The biggest one's very high, but this one made me smile the most. It's called the German Super Deep Hole and was a project that ended in drilling in 1994. Like the other borehole on the list, the intent was to dig as deep as possible into the earth to find out what it was like both rock-wise and heat-wise. Yet one person had a completely different idea. Her name was Lotte Given, and she was an artist, and a question that she wanted answered was, what does the earth sound like? She laughed when she posed it because real scientists felt that they already knew there was no sound. The Earth's too deep to make such sound. But she didn't believe them, so she did her own experiment. Lowering a geophone, a device that can pick up faint sounds, she soon found out that the device recorded things beyond the human hearing level. Given translated the ultrasonic waves into something that people could hear via a computer program. And the result? A thunderstorm-like sound, yet people could also hear what they felt sounded like a heartbeat. Well, the planet is alive, so why wouldn't its core be like a heart? Number 5. The Dead Sea Sinkholes I touched on sinkholes before, but this is on a much grander scale. In the Dead Sea, an alarming amount of sinkholes are being made. To prove just how scary this is, in the last 15 years alone, more than a thousand sinkholes have appeared within the sea. There are a lot of reasons for this occurrence, but one of the biggest is that the Dead Sea is getting a lot smaller. In fact, it's about one-third the size that it was in the 1960s. Due to the Jordan River not feeding enough water, the sea draining, and through all of that, the ground beneath the water becoming weaker, when it becomes weak enough, a sinkhole then forms. The ironic thing is that this used to be a popular vacation destination, as well as a place for religious people to make pilgrimage to. Yet, because of the dangers of the area, as well as the sinking water height, it's now a more restricted area. Number 4. Dean's Blue Hole You see, we just talked about sinkholes that can form under the sea. But this is a little bit different. This is a massive hole located in the Bahamas. Dean's Blue Hole is 663 feet deep, and because of how it's formed, you can see it from the surface of the water, and it's much darker in blue color because of it. The hole itself is the deepest underwater blue hole in the world, twice the size of anything that's even close to it, and because of that, its location is in the Bahamas. There's even a world record of who had dived the deepest into the hole without oxygen or other diving gear. 331 feet, which is incredibly impressive, though there have been casualties of those trying to break the record. There's even yearly diving events that attract hundreds to see who can be the best in various competition. Now aside from humans, there are actually quite a few species of sea creature that live in the blue hole. Fish, turtles, and more call it home, and many people dive down just to see it. Number 3. The Black Hole of Andros If Dean's Blue Hole was wonderful to you, the Black Hole of Andros is exactly the opposite, for if you go there, you're likely going to die. While it is in the Bahamas, the island of South Andros is definitely one you don't want to visit. This island contains a black hole that's inhospitable to an extreme degree. It's so bad, in fact, you can't walk to the black hole. To see it, you have to fly over, and when you do, you see just how dark it is. So why is it blackish purple? Wedged between two levels of air and non-air is a thick layer of bacteria. Even worse, the bacteria is toxic. But wait, there's more. The water is also toxic, containing hydrogen sulfide. So there have been people who have swam through it and noted some interesting things when they did. Like how the layer is like swimming through jelly. But if you go to this place, you just need to be careful. Number 2. The Cola Super Deep Borehole Since humanity has began to wonder more about the planet we live on, the desires to dig deep into the Earth have become a fascination. Some people even think it's possible to dig their way to China from the United States. Thankfully, an idea that was debunked. But it bears to ask, what is the deepest hole that science has ever dug? And for those of you who guessed, well, that would be the Cola Super Deep Borehole. 
This massive hole was dug as part of a project that took place in Russia lasting from 1970 to 1994. And by the end of the experiment, they'd gone seven and a half miles into the Earth. Now, as this was a scientific endeavor, the teams hoped to find some interesting things as they dug down. And they did. They found remnants of life from a time long ago, and it was deep into the earth, in a place that couldn't have been found without this kind of drilling. Also, they learned more about the earth's core and the temperatures that were there, the deeper they went down. Ironically, as it was increased in temperature that caused the project to stop, there was no way to continue drilling. But though it stopped, the endeavor itself was marked a success. And remember, it was all done without the benefit of modern technology. Number 1. The Song Doom Cave You might be wondering, why is a cave at the top of a list about holes? Well, it's not because Shia LaBeouf is in there, it's because the cave is the largest in the world, and it can only be accessed via a hole that honestly shouldn't have been found in the first place. The cave itself is in Vietnam, and the hole serves as an entrance point located in its thick jungles. Scientists feel that it was fortunate that the man who found it found it at all. But even more crazy is that inside of this massive cave exists an entire ecosystem. Or to put it more simple, an entire jungle. Not only that, this jungle cave is full of wildlife, and there are some sections of the cave that are so tall that they can fit a section of the city in them. The cave is revered as one of the greatest discoveries ever found, and it's all because of a hole that led to a bigger one. Thanks for watching! Did you have your mind blown about these holes? And which holes are your favorite? Let me know in the comments below. Be sure you subscribe, and I'll see you next time on World 5.